Yo, what is good everybody? I just accidentally started a stream on my other account. But we are here with a little 99 James Harden grind. Not 99. I wish it was 99. It's 96 James Harden. Still a ridiculously nice card. I am going to be attempting to grind for him. So I figure while we do that, we can do a little Q&A. What is up, everybody? We got Supreme Nation, Matthew Walker, ISO Plays, Mr. Nice Guy, Dr. Three Point. Wow. Jeremy, Pedro, Pierre, Mark Rank. Triton Y, Stefan, Mark, Chris Wavy, Boss Madden, Noah Muhammad, Dylan, what is good everybody? Thank you all for joining the stream. So like I said, we are on the road to that 96 James Harden. Shout out to everybody joining the stream right now. Really appreciate all of you guys. And I'm just now realizing that I don't have the stream entirely correctly set up, but I'm going to keep an eye on the comments. What's good, Keek? Thanks for joining. What is good, everybody? Thoughts on the challenge? Well, he took the video down, so I think that tells you all you need to know about it. <laughs> the chat is on slow-mo. If I don't put it on slow-mo, we're going to have way too many people there. How many tokens do I have? That is a good question. Dang, that was a 4-4 four four quarter. That's a little bit disappointing. Let me check my tokens progress. All I've really done so far is autoplay head-to-head -head quarters, but I think we're pretty good ways into it. Let me go over here and take a look, see what we've got open pack. We've, I think we've also stacked up quite a few highlight reel tokens as well. If we hop on over here, I am... Let's see, 16, 18. So not as far as I could be, but you know me. I got other things to do as well, but I am going to get that 96 James Harden. I promise you guys that. I'll probably do gameplay with somebody else's account, and I'll be uh, I'll be interested to see the reactions on that. But <laughs> if we had an NBA 2K tournament, I would win. Hmm. I, I think I would have to play you myself in order to know that. You should grind the steals, threes, rebounds, and dunks in season. It's easy. Then do head-to-head -head for the quarter wins. Well, right now, I'm just going to be doing, like, Q&A on the stream. So you guys are welcome to ask me any questions that you want to. We're just going to kind of be chatting. Questions are welcome. I believe my roommate is supposed to be joining me, but he's... Uh, he told me to go downstairs and start the stream, and now he's not joining me. So he should be down here in a minute. If you got any questions for him about me, or I don't know. I don't know what else you would have questions about, but you can ask him whatever the heck you want. I gotta delete this random stream that I accidentally put up, but here we go. What's my last name? I'm not gonna tell you that. <laughs> Do I have a roommate? Yes, I have two roommates. What's good? Thanks everybody for joining. What do you use to record your stream screen and Elgato capture card and OBS? What shoes did you buy? I'm not sure what shoes you're talking about. I'm glad coin selling is done. I'm glad that you're glad, but I'm not glad. Favorite football team is the Panthers. How old am I? I am 22 years old. Let's see. Let me get this uh, chat minimized a little bit so that I can still see what's happening. What is good? Okay, how old am I? 22. Can I have a shout out? Yes, you can, Sam Bam. I love your power. Um, I don't know what that means, but thank you. Do NBA 2K18 series. I think you're going to get million coin there. Um, I'm enjoying 2K, but I'm not really sure what that means. <laughs> Are you using the facing bums method to win quarters? Yes, I am using the facing bums method to win quarters. We're up 11 to 5 right now. Shout out to Damra Boys, Dylan Lawrence. Why you shaved your beard? People that don't have beards don't usually realize this, but beards are a little bit obnoxious. I'm not, like, I enjoy having a beard sometimes because it does mean that you don't have to shave it. But especially when it gets long, you got to take, like, a lot of care of it. You got to shampoo it and condition it and trim it. And mine still didn't look all that good even when I did it, so... Do you prefer 2K or NBA Live Mobile? If you're talking like 2K console, then definitely 2K. The gameplay is like not even remotely close. I do enjoy like the card aspect of NBA Live Mobile, but 2K in my opinion. Yes, I saw his challenge. No, I'm not accepting it. I'm not letting him tell me how to run my channel. 
Oh my goodness. Favorite player from Croatia. Honestly, I cannot tell you a player from Croatia. Did we just get an autoplay alley-oop attempt? I've never seen that before. That's interesting. When do I think I'm going to get James Harden 96? Probably next couple weeks. I'm not sure. It's going to take a while. Are you rich from YouTube? No, I'm not rich. I do well enough to survive, but I definitely wouldn't say I'm rich. Who's your favorite NBA player? Kemba Walker, but I'm like low-key hoping the Hornets trade him because we got to do something to rebuild this team, guys. I don't know what's going on with my Hornets right now, but we got to do something to... You suck! You're a bandwagon Sixers fan! Sorry, that's my roommate. OKC just won against the Hornets. I know. The Hornets... <sighs> Something's got to change. We need a new coach, or we need to trade Kemba and get some pieces to build with. Oh, yep, if he was rich from YouTube, he would buy his mama a new car. Especially now that coin sponsors are gone, I'm not going to be rich. <laughs> At least not anytime soon. It'll be pretty cool if you did a collab with QJB. Well, now that I don't have a coin sponsor, I probably could, but uh, I, don't, I don't think that QJB would be doing that anytime soon. You're the only YouTuber that actually reads the comments on streams. I'm not the only one, but I appreciate it. I'm glad you guys appreciate it. Who's your favorite player from the Hornets? Like I said, Kimball Walker. Would I take five million for your YouTube channel? Yes. Then I would just go start another YouTube channel. I already have another YouTube channel started, so no issue right there. Kimball Walker or Jalen Brown for All-Star? I would definitely... For All-Star, definitely Kimball Walker. I think the Hornets definitely need to trade some of their shooting guards. I don't know why they've got so many shooting guards. It's kind of ridiculous. Who's rookie of the year for you? I got Kuzma or Simmons. I've got like a top four. I don't know if I could say a top two yet. I mean, Sim Simmons is obviously number one. I'd say Simmons, Tatum, Kuzma, and Mitchell. Why am I a Hornets fan? Because I, I live in Charlotte and I'm not a bandwagon. What's my second favorite team? That's, well... Probably the Pistons. I used to be a huge Pistons fan uh, back in like 2003, 2004, because my family is from Michigan. Um, so I was a Pistons fan whenever the Bobcats were in Charlotte. I don't think I was ever really a Bobcats fan, although I do have like a Bobcats hat around here that my roommate got for me for Christmas. I want to donate $10. Let's see. I believe there's actually a... Uh, there's probably a link for it down in the stream. It is actually right there. If you want to donate to the stream, you can. Whoop. Press the wrong button. Let me scroll back up. I hear that Keek is one of your favorite YouTubers. Is that true? Yes, Keek is definitely one of my favorite YouTubers. No, unfortunately, I don't think the Hornets are going to make the playoffs. I wish that they would, but... I don't see it happening anytime soon. What do I think about the Warriors? I'm actually... I'm more of... I'm like a low-key Warriors fan. I don't think you can actually, I don't think you can have like a basketball presence online and be a Warriors fan and people not give you crap about it. So I said I'm not a bang, okay, you see, I'm not a bandwagon because I've always been a Hornets fan. I've just never been a Bobcats fan. Two different things. Ha ha ha. How's grinding going? It's all right. I don't. <laughs> I don't think really anybody does much of the grinding like all themselves. I think a lot of people probably autoplay it, which is the smart way to go. Like always work smarter, not harder. That's what I always say. We just beat y'all 101-91. I know the Hornets are bad. Who's better, Devin Booker or Kemba? Honestly, this season, Devin Booker might be even better. You know what's crazy? The Hornets could have drafted Devin Booker. Just about every Hornets fan wanted them to draft Devin Booker, but you know who they drafted instead? Frank Kaminsky. Frank freaking Kaminsky. What do you think of Mike Michael Jordan, 99 overall? I think we'll get, by the end of the season, I have a feeling we'll have cards that are over 100. Well, no, they might still cap them at 99, but still, they're going to be nice. I don't have Curry yet. I'm waiting for the prices to drop. Huge shout out to 2 k Ake for letting me use his account. That way, I didn't have to waste a bunch of coins to get Curry. Um... Yeah, huge shout out to him. I might actually uh, be making a video. So he actually lives like 10 minutes from where I live. So we might do a 1v1 if you guys want to see that. Let me drop a like if you guys want to see a 1v1 versus subscriber. I think that'd be pretty interesting. I don't even know 
almost. I think he's like 16 years old, but I don't know anything about him, like whether or not he's athletic or anything. So it'll be interesting to see how that works out. Whoa! Eagles with the dub? All right, nice. Wu is also a bandwagon Eagles fan. I thought he was going to join me for the live stream, but apparently not. Thanks for liking. Thanks for subscribing. Appreciate it, you guys. Who do I think will be MVP? At the start of the season, I was definitely thinking James Harden. But he's uh, he's dropped off a little bit. James Harden has not been himself, and he got injured. So it'll be interesting. I think LeBron's got a pretty good shot. I think Giannis is also going to have a shot if he keeps up the way he's been playing. Uh, what? That, oh my gosh, you are the worst roommate. You are literally the absolute worst. Who do I think is the GOAT? Michael Jordan. I like the stream. Hey, I appreciate it. Thanks for subscribing. Red Card Gaming. What do I think is the best player of all time? Like I said, Michael Jordan. Do I like Arvidius Sabonis? He's definitely improved a lot this season. I haven't been paying a ton of attention to him, but it seems like... Pretty much everybody that leaves Russell Westbrook team ends up becoming, like, really, really good. So, interesting to see how that works. I wonder if it'll continue or if that's just, like, a one-time thing. Let me, let me launch the subscriber notification thing so that we actually get our shout-outs for you guys whenever you do hit the subscribe button down below. So I'm going to go ahead and drop that on the screen right there. So now we should get that pop-up every time somebody subscribes. I'll, I'll see it if it pops up right now. And I can close that out because I deleted that unnecessary stream. Okay, okay, back to the live stream. Which rookie has surprised you the most this year? How were the tacos? We actually did not even have tacos, Mama Buckets. Um... I was, okay, so at first, I didn't want to have tacos, because Brett wasn't here and I knew Brett wanted to have tacos, and then Wu decided he wanted to eat chicken nuggets instead, so I guess we're just like never having tacos, because Wu's not going to be here tomorrow, but it's his taco meat, so I don't know. Why am I talking about this on the live stream? <laughs> what do I think is the worst team? I would say probably the Hawks. The Bulls have been improving a little bit, so right now I'd say... The Hawks probably have the lead as the worst team in the NBA. When Kemba was a rookie, who's better, him or Donovan Mitchell? Um, yes, you're not gonna. I'm pretty sure you're not gonna be there. Hey, there we go. The subscriber notifications have been turned on. Yeah, Wu got himself an almost girlfriend. Welcome, King Sh. Hey, King Shaggy, welcome to the squad. I forgot I used to do that. I only do that like on the other one, but I'll I'll try to keep doing that on this one. Whoa! We got another subscriber. Welcome to the squad. Where am I going? Who's going to get a girlfriend? Lonzo Ball is better than Kemba Walker. Okay, that's just that's just wrong. Hey, welcome to Chad Hart. Chad Harding, welcome to the squad. We got another subscriber, Nathan Wide. Welcome to the squad. Woo is yelling, "Welcome to the squad!" Upstairs, but because he's lazy and won't join the live stream. Caden Escover, welcome to the squad, 1v1 versus Jordan or Bird. Are you asking me, like, what I would do? Matas Gagalas, welcome to the squad. What do I think about Westbrook's triple-double? He does that on a pretty regular basis. It's nothing surprising. Jesuiver, I don't know if I pronounced that right. Welcome to the squad. Welcome to the you need to do a 75,000 subscriber special. I know, guys. Okay, so I actually, I tweeted this out earlier today. Let me see what I tweeted out as the options for my for my 70,000 subscriber special. So, what should I do for 75,000 subscribers? Get a 75 shaved in my hair, a 7.5 hour live stream, 750 made three pointers or all of the above. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section, guys. I sub, but it didn't show. It might be because we're getting too many subscribers right now. Who is the greatest player ever? Michael Jordan. Wu, I don't know if Wu is in the... Is Wu... Hey, are you going to actually, like, join the stream? No. Why are you here? Yeah, that's what I thought. What? Thank you for subscribing. What's my roommate's name? My roommate's name is Wu. W-O-O. -O. If you want, I can give you his full name. 
and you can go look him up on all, all social media platforms. Why don't I accept Buck's challenge? Because Buck's not gonna accept his own challenge. <laughs> Uh, I'm not, I'm not getting into it. I can talk to you about it later, but he's just, he's just being childish. Okay. Yeah, and then he deleted it. <laughs> Prank your roommate? I mean, he's right here, so I'm not sure how well that would work. Oh, he doesn't want to start that. Yeah, I know. Oh, he doesn't want it. I know. Can you change the sub animation to LeBron dunking? <laughs> nah. What song is um, what? Yeah, Kanye. it's no. It looks like Kanye. This guy, so this guy was like, could have been Kanye, but ended up not being Kanye, and he stopped making music. He's really good. He only has like four songs that he's dropped, but he's still really good. Hey, thanks for subscribing. I'm not sure who that was. Mark Golden, welcome to the squad. It, it shouldn't be too loud. Oh, I'm loud. Okay. Wait, can you hear me in there? No. Oh. Oop. Okay, okay. Does Wu play NBA Live Mobile? Nope, he, uh... So, whenever the game reset, he was gonna play NBA Live Mobile, and then... He played it with me for a little bit and realized that it was trash, so he stopped playing. I had no motivation to play it because I wasn't making video Oh, and no, then... No and then Brett tried to play NBA Live Mobile when it reset... Oh, that's your phone. Brett tried to pr play it when he reset, and uh, he couldn't even play it because he had an iPhone 6, and it was so glitchy on the iPhone 6 that he couldn't even get the game start. Does Wu like 2K? Wu has played 2K. He could not. They know me as Bobby. My real name is Drake. I think most of you guys probably know that. But you could not beat Bobby. Brett can't even beat Bobby. Come on now. Welcome to Lost Dream. Welcome to the squad. They said rice gum in the back. Hey, welcome to Leo Cardi Luisson. Luisson? Huh? <laughs> MBLG, we was gonna unmod you because you called him rice gum. Is Draymond Green out of position a good snipe? Well, you didn't tell me the price, so there's. Do not! Do not! Okay. <laughs> what do I think about Donovan Mitchell possibly being invited to the dunk? He definitely needs to be in the dunk contest. I would say he's easily top four dunkers in the NBA. Dude is a monster. Who? Donovan Mitchell? What is my best NBA live mobile card? Probably... What just... What did Kawhi Leonard just do? The ball just bounced off of his hand. Best NBA live mobile player is probably 97 Iverson. At least in regards to my opinions. Like I said, what about Buck's challenge? He's not going to follow through on it because he already deleted the video. So I'm not going to pay any attention to it. Thanks for subscribing, Jaden Florence and Victoria Aguirre. Play with other YouTubers. Are you talking 2K or NBA Live Mobile? Probably the biggest, the toughest thing about NBA Live Mobile is there's no way to like truly play head to head. Like when you do head to head... It's never at the same time, so it's like, eh. Eh. Woo, you, like, haven't played NBA Live Mobile in, like, five months. Was Lonzo Ball overrated in the draft? Yes, he and Markel Fultz, I would say both definitely. Probably Josh Jackson was as well. Markel Fultz is a bust! He's a bust! You would not destroy me in 2K. Get out of here. Get out of here. I've been rolling in 2K lately. Welcome, Bob Dylan, to the squad. Let's see. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for subscribing, Eli, Eli Lauterbeck. What's the song? This is Good Weather by the Proletarians. This is actually, this is the group that, or the artist that Jester the Laser usually uses in his outro. But they are, they're definitely, I wish they were still making music. So they're not anymore. Do another collab with Roland? Do you guys want to see like an NBA Live Mobile collab with Roland? Or do you want to see another IRL video with him? Because we can do either one. He's not all that far away, but I need to know what you guys think. What's your real name? My real name is Drake. What do I think about Kobe? I think he was he's an all-time great basketball player. Is LaMelo the best ball brother? Nope. If I were to rank him, I would say Lonzo, LaMelo, LiAngelo. I don't think LiAngelo is going to even see the NBA. Might not even see the G League. I think LaMelo will at least make the G League, but I'm not sure if he'll make the NBA. And obviously, Lonzo's already in the NBA. 
Uh, okay, you want to see collabs in NBA Live Mobile and IRL? Okay. Okay, I'm not playing Broccoli. I'm not trying to get copyrighted. What is up? Play Soda Dungeon. That is a major throwback. That was, that was actually the first game that ever made it big on my channel. I think Soda Dungeon videos were actually my most viewed videos in a long, long, long time. Oh, I would love to do a collab with Jester the Laser, but I don't see that happening anytime soon. We got another subscriber. Welcome to the squad. Thanks for subscribing, Zena Omasan. Is LeBron leaving Cleveland next season? I think he could, but I doubt it. Is LeVar Ball an idiot or a genius? I like to say that LeVar Ball is a professional idiot, and because of that, He's actually a genius. So, yes, he's obnoxious. Yes, nobody really wants to hear what he says. Well, actually, there are people that want to, want to hear what he says. That's why he's able to stay relevant for so long without actually even doing anything in the sports world. It's because he can get people's attention and annoy the crap out of people. And people still want to hear about it. People will still pay attention to it. So, it is what it is. LeBron's not... Yeah, LeBron's probably not leaving. Who's better? Who's a better rookie, Ben Simmons or Lonzo Ball? What kind of question is that? Obviously, Ben Simmons. Come on now, Kemba or Lillard? Tell the truth. Uh, like telling the truth, even if I weren't telling the truth, you guys don't realize. Like, yes, I'm a Hornets fan, but I try to say as unbiased as I can when it comes to NBA stuff. I would de definitely take Lillard over Kemba. Kemba just really hasn't been all that good for us recently. I want to destroy you in 2K. Ha! You thought! Never gonna happen. You should collab with QJB. You should go tell him that. <laughs> I'm not the one that you need to tell that. I would collab with QJB anytime, but you gotta go tell QJB that I should collab with him. What's my 100,000 subscriber special? Well, we gotta get the 75K subscriber special before we get the 100,000 one. What's up, Raining Gaming? Would I play some Tupac? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'm going to keep the same playlist going. Who's your least favorite player on the Hornets? Probably Frank Kamin either Frank Kaminsky or Nick Batum. Honestly, the Hornets frustrate the crap out of me sometimes. <laughs> Probably Frank Kaminsky, though. Mainly because we could have had Devin Booker and we ended up with him instead. What's my favorite song? Do I have a favorite song right now? Anything by Chance the Rapper, blah. Anything by Chance the Rapper is my favorite song. That's not the name of the song. I'm just saying, like, I like Anything by Chance. What's up, Boss Plays CTR? Welcome to the squad. Thanks for subscribing. What's the most I spent on a card? 100 million coins on uh, 91 Clay, which was not like now looking back at it, I wish that I hadn't done that because if I could have that 100 mil now, I could buy so much more with it, but. It is what it is. Biggest draft steal this year is probably Donovan Mitchell. Um, I'm trying to think. Donovan Mitchell or Kyle Kuzma, I would say. One of those two. Do I have a girlfriend? No, I do not. Thanks for subscribing, bro and sis. A hey, what's up, Nathan Willis. Thanks for joining. Dwight's the worst player on the horn. Get out of here. Dwight is the second best, maybe the first best player on the Hornets. Dwight has been a beast this season. What are you talking about? Like, I understand if you want to talk crap about the Hornets, talk crap about the Hornets. But Dwight Howard is not by any means the worst player on the Hornets. Where? Okay, timers. That's what I need. I need to, I need to throw in a timer for... Actually, I gotta... Oh! Okay, add... If you want to donate to the stream, donate to the stream at blank. Okay, is that? Nope, that's not right. Where do you where do you go to donate to the stream? I'm trying to. Oh yeah, it's down in my description. One second, give me a second, guys. It's down in the description, but most people probably. And I'm just now realizing that I've still got my MMO Go links down in the description as well. Silly Bobby. Okay. Goats only. Goats only. There we go. Okay, and we're going to set that up for every six minutes. Yeah, that looks good. Submit. 
Okay, on to the next game. We are rolling right now. Let's see. We're, we're actually up to, uh, we got a good bit of path name is required. Nope. Oh, no, autoplay. Oh, forgot to press it soon enough. Donate. Okay, okay, okay. Submit. All right, back in the live stream. Let's see. We got 250 people watching. Do I like Fortnite? I tried Fortnite. I'm gonna not gonna lie to you guys. I'm really bad at Fortnite. If you guys wanted me to p play Fortnite, you would probably want to check it out on my other channel. So that is Bobby Plays. Uh, what's IRL? IRL stands for in real life. So if you wanted me to play Fortnite, I definitely do that on my Bobby Plays channel. That's where I do pretty much anything non NBA Live Mobile. Let's see, back to the chat. I gotta scroll back up. I keep losing it. Do I like LeBron James? Uh, being honest, I'm not like a huge LeBron James fan. I would say... Let's see, can I get a link for the sponsor button? Um, I don't know. I don't even know if I can get a link for the sponsor button. Kyle or Donovan? Kyle, talking Kyle Kuzma? I'd probably take Donovan. Kyle Kuzma takes some stupid shots, so uh, while he's a great player, he's definitely got some maturing to do. And part of that's because he can, because he's on one of the worst teams in the league. Uh, in a few years, they'll be great, but right now they're still one of the worst. Do some 2K pack openings. Uh, 2K pack openings are expensive. I'm not sure if you guys have checked the VC prices recently, but they're not cheap. No, I'm not married. Not married, not dating, no nothing. Who's my favorite 2K YouTuber? Obviously, Jester the Laser, although he doesn't really do that much 2K anymore. Only reason he did 2K in December was because of the, what was it, the 25 days of Vlogmas or whatever it was that they were doing. What do I think about Gerald Green? I think he was a steal for the Rockets. I was surprised he wasn't picked up before now because he's, like, he's straight up a scoring machine. People go to NBA games to watch scoring, not really for, like, they don't go for defense. Like, defense is obviously a good thing. You want your team to be good at defense, but people don't go to NBA games to watch defense. Bobby knows is... Ooh, we got that buzzer beater from Allen Iverson right there. Shoot with... Our, yeah, Iverson just shot right there. Kyrie or Lillard? Uh, honestly, this season... Before this season, I probably would have said Lillard, but I'm going to take Kyrie this season. He's definitely having a breakout season. Why are none of these working? There we go. Isn't Porzingis underrated? Ah, uh, no, I think he's... I think most people appreciate him, like, the correct amount. Um... Let's see. What's my highest overall? I think it's 98 Rudy Gobert. Dude is a monster. What do I think about QJB? I think he's a great YouTuber. I don't think he's, like, a huge NBA Live Mobile fan, but I think he does a really good job of making his pack openings entertaining. Kyrie or Curry? Definitely Curry. Lillard or Westbrook? Definitely Westbrook. LeBron or Durant? LeBron's the better player. Durant's the better scorer. Kyrie is a little bit of a ball hog, but he's a bit, he's been improving a lot. Lillard is overrated. I would disagree with you on that one. It looks like you're a James Harden fan, and honestly, I used to think James Harden was like far and away best player in the league, not overrated at all, but after watching him more, I'm starting to think he's slightly overrated just because a lot of his ability comes from the system that he's in. Don't get me wrong, he can create shots, he can get assists and all that, but uh, I think James Harden's still got a long ways to go. Not a long ways to go, just some adjustments that he can make to make his team better. DeRozan or Harden? Definitely Harden. Not even close. Do I like the Bulls? I mean, I don't dislike them. They're not any good. My favorite college basketball team is Duke. Ugh. Ugh, you're one of those guys. Unless you have a parent or family member that went to Duke, I I don't respect your Duke, your Duke fandom, I guess would be the term. Like, I, I just can't respect it. Axelia, thanks for subscribing. What the? Oh, that's... <laughs> That's the pop-up for my other channel, I just realized. That's funny. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even realize I had two of them on there. Okay, what do I think about Chris Smoove? I don't really watch him. I know he's like one of the, or used to be the biggest 2K YouTuber, I think. 
Um, he does really good NBA analysis, I think. Selling 93 overall franchise plus 50, 90 overall franchise for $50. Eh, sounds pretty good. You're not a bandwagon? Did, did your parents go to Duke? Did you go to Duke? Oh my gosh. Are you being, Raining Gaming, are you being serious? If you're being serious, I'm just going to, uh, you know what? We don't, we don't need that in here regardless of whether or not he's telling the truth. I don't even care. I'm still removing that comment. What's up, stud bros? Welcome to the squad. Welcome to the squad. Do a shopping spree. I can't do shopping sprees all the more anytime, guys. <laughs> oh, shopping sprees are going to be, they're going to be a lot fewer and far between. LeBron leaving Cleveland and going he, if he leaves Cleveland he's definitely not going to OKC he could not be on the same team as Westbrook he has to own the team and Westbrook has to own the team so it wouldn't work out Shaq or Yao Ming definitely Shaq it's not even close Yao Ming was great simply because really more well known because of his height and he kind of like broke down the barrier for Asian players, so yeah, that's no question Shaq in that contest. Giannis or Durantula? Uh, right now I'd say Durant's probably a better player, but I think in a couple years Giannis could be the best player in the league. Do I think DeAndre Jordan is going to get traded to the Cavs? Mm, actually, I think I've heard rumors about that. It could happen. You never know. What seems more realistic, LeBron to Philly or L.A.? Probably more realistic would be to L.A., but I don't think he's going to either of them. Does it matter that I didn't go to Duke? I mean, if you didn't go to Duke and you don't know anybody that went to Duke, then you're, you probably just cheer for Duke because you're good. So I don't respect your fandom. Like, sorry. Especially if you're not from North Carolina. Then being a Duke fan, it just comes down to, yeah, I cheer for them because they're good. 96 Harden all the way. Like, I bet you don't cheer for Duke in football. I bet you only are a Duke fan when it comes to basketball, and that's probably about it. Do I think Kemba's being traded? Yeah, I have a feeling that's probably going to happen sometime soon. I completed the set James Harden. I did it. No, you didn't. It's literally impossible to have completed the James Harden by now. Lonzo or Fox? Right now, I'm still taking Lonzo, but it could be different in the future. I think Fox still has some growing to do. Yao Ming or Manu Bull? That's tough for me to say because Manu Bull played when I wasn't alive. Why don't I answer your questions? Uh, there are a lot of questions. I'm from NC and go for Duke. Uh, I'm sorry. I just, I, I can't deal with Duke fans. Can't do it. Just can't do it. Who's better, Kyrie or Curry? Curry. Who's going to win the NBA championship? Probably the Warriors again. OKC took the W tonight. Yes, I'm well aware. They beat the Hornets. Blah, blah, blah. Completed 20 out of 49. Nice, nice. I think I'm at somewhere between 18 and 20 right now. We're at 18 at the start of the stream. Let me see where we are on our achievements. So I need to win season games. That'll actually give me a bunch of tokens right there. Head to headquarters. For some reason, when I autoplay season mode on my computer, it crashes. Uh... So I'm not sure what I need to do about that. I need to do more live events. That's for sure. Gameplay points. Are we close in any of these? So we're still like 300 points away for the next points achievement. We're going to go ahead and resume on this one. How long have I been at MSU? No, I actually don't go to MSU. My dad went to Michigan State. So I've been a Michigan State fan my whole life. I actually go to UNC Charlotte, which is the same colors, and I could understand why it would look like I go to MSU, because I wear MSU stuff all the time, but you might notice I also wear Charlotte stuff all the time, so that would be why. 25 out of 49 for Harden, nice. What do you think when you, what, oh, when do I think I'll complete Harden? Probably in the next couple weeks. Harden or Corver? What kind of a question is that? Obviously Harden. And the app crash. Great, great, great. Coin making methods? Right now there aren't really any great coin making methods. Isaiah Thomas or Kyle Lowry? Right now I'm going to take Kyle Lowry because Isaiah Thomas is still coming back. Would I rather have five signature players or one Harden? It depends on what signature players you're talking If you're talking like five 93 plus signature players, then I'm definitely going to take the signature players. But... 
if it's 90 overall signature players, then I'm definitely going to take the hardest. And all right, when that jump ball, open all your unclaimed packs. Nah, those are being saved up for a future video. Chamberlain or Russell? I'm going to give it to Russell just because of his championships. I have 17 collectibles for Harden. Nice. Is 99 Brian Scalabrini? Uh, what are you talking about? I don't, I don't know how to read that. Why don't I buy the Christmas edition LeBron? He's so good. Are you talking the signature one? Like, there, that guy hasn't ever been on the auction house. That's not an option. <laughs> Hold up. Did I turn off the wrong notification thing? Let me make sure I didn't turn off the wrong notification thing. Okay. AC. Okay. Yep, that's the right one. Okay. I just had to make sure because we weren't getting any subscriber notifications. Leonard or Pierce? Ha that's such a tough comparison because one's in the league and one isn't in the in isn't in the league anymore. So I'm not sure you can really compare them like that. Who do you think I should buy Westbrook or Curry? Once again, you gotta give me like details, guys. You gotta give me details, overalls, programs, whatever. Would you rather have Curry go to the Hornets or the? Obviously, the Hornets. I would love for Curry to go to the Hornets. I have 90 Legend Lonzo Ball. Nice. Do I think LeBron will go back to Miami? No. If he goes anywhere, he's definitely not going back to Miami. Hey, Tiandre TV. No self-promotion. Best ball handler ever? Well, that's tough for me to say because I haven't really paid a ton of attention um, to ball handlers throughout the ages. I would say the best current ball handler is definitely Kyrie. But it would be tough for me to say best ball handler ever. What do I think of DeAndre Jordan for the first Nets pick, Tristan Thompson and Fry? Sounds like a pretty good trade. Tristan Thompson's like way, way overpaid. Which is more real realistic? Fox becoming the next Wall or Ingram becoming the next Durant? I would say probably Ingram becoming the next Durant. Fox hasn't shown enough promise yet for me to be able to say that he's going to be the next John Wall. But I think Ingram showed enough improvement for me to at least compare him to Durant. Vince Carter, Manu Ginobili, Vince Carter. LeBron James, yep, I would say LeBron's the best player in the NBA. I'm guessing Wu's going to try to scare me in a second here because I heard him run down the stairs. Should I get Curry or Wall, both 84 overall? I would get the Curry. Shout out to Torrent Gaming. Thanks for, oh, sorry about that. Just realized that we were stuck right there. Donovan or Tatum? I'm going to take Donovan Mitchell right now. I think that a lot of Tatum's efficiency is coming from the teammates that he's surrounded with. Gosh, you are creepy. Um, so I think if you switch them on different teams, that Tatum wouldn't be playing nearly as well. Since there are no more coin sellers, will there be more coin packs? That's what I'm hoping. I'm hoping that that was what they were going to do once they got rid of the coin sellers. So... Hopefully this Monday, or maybe this Tuesday, we'll be seeing some coin bundles. That's what they've done in Madden Mobile, so I'm hoping they do it in NBA Live Mobile. Allen Iverson is the best Sixers player ever. Um, It's probably between him, Dr. J. I think Wilt played for the Sixers as well at one point. Woo, best Sixers player ever. Why, why are you holding toilet paper? What is wrong with you? There's more toilet paper. You're not funny. Who's the best player in NBA Live Mobile? Probably... I mean, probably the 96 James Harden, but nobody has him yet. Lonzo or Dennis Smith Jr.? Right now, I'm taking Dennis Smith Jr. Who do I think I should buy? Westbrook 85 or Curry 84? Oh, I would take the... I'd probably take the 85 Westbrook. He's going to be better defensively, and he can still do most things well. Allen Iverson or Kyrie? Allen Iverson. What, a, what kind of question is that? Who you have in a 1v1, LeVar or Jordan? Come on now. Come on now. Give some respect to Jordan. No need for that nonsense. Oh, that's why I'm not seeing the subscriber notifications. Because it's all the way down there. If Kawhi gets another big injury, is his career over? No. Why? He's super young. Why would it, that be his career over? Who's the best Charlotte Hornet? It's between... Sorry. Between Dwight Howard and Kemba. I think Kemba's still the best, but Dwight Howard's having a pretty good season. 
What are your thoughts about Domantas Sabonis? I think he's vastly improved, turning into a pretty good player. Nice, 23 collectibles on the way to getting that 96 Harden. LeBron to the Lakers. I that wasn't me. I didn't say that. Thoughts on Derrick Rose? He's washed up. Could have been great, but too many injuries. Best dunker ever. This probably like if we're talking pure dunker, not necessarily in-game dunker, like pure dunker. I don't think I've ever seen a dunk as amazing as the one that Aaron Gordon did in the dunk contest against Zach Levine where he jumped over a mascot, went underneath his legs, and dunked it. On the first try. I've never seen a dunk like that before. I would say that's the best dunk I've ever seen. So by that standard, I would say Aaron Gordon, either Aaron Gordon or Zach Levine. I think Aaron Gordon's more creative, so that's why it was more impressive. Uh, Zach Levine's more athletic, probably. But I would say if we're talking just like straight up dunk contest dunker, we got another buzzer beater right there. Then I'm going to take one of those two, but in-game dunker, that's a tough one. LeBron's a pretty good in-game dunker, although there's not like a ton of creativity. Uh, Prime Derrick Rose was a nasty in-game dunker. That one's pretty crazy. Fox or D'Angelo for the Hornets? I would definitely take D'Angelo over Fox. I saw that video. I'm not sure what video. I can't remember what I said before. Porzingis or Durant? I don't know. Well, uh, I would take Durant. I would take Durant still. No question. Definitely taking Durant. Let's see. Let's see. Who do I think is playing better, Brandon Ingram or Kyle Kuzma? I think Ingram's playing more efficiently, but Kuz still has good stats because he takes so many shots. 46 to 49 on Master Harden. I don't believe you. Tweet me a screenshot and then I will believe you. But I don't believe that you're 46 out of 49. Durant, Durant easily. Did I did I not say Durant? I think I wasn't. I was like not paying attention when I answered that question. Definitely Durant. Porzingis or Cat? This season, definitely Porzingis. Last season it looked like Cat was going to be the best center in the league. But he, uh, he kind of fell off a little bit this season. Also, he can't play defense. Rose is coming back the NBA or is he retiring well I think he's coming back I think he made that decision but he's not gonna be the same he's just too injury prone there's not really anything he can do about that it's not his fault Ryan and Ryan Anderson dunked for the first time yesterday it wasn't the first time that he ever dunked but it was a nice dunk it was nice he posterized somebody I can't remember who it was best guard dunker if you're talking in the NBA right now probably Westbrook would I have anybody over Westbrook as a guard? Ah, uh, maybe Donovan Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell might be a better dunker. I might have to take him over Westbrook. DeAndre Jordan or Boogie? I'm going to take Boogie. Yeah, that's kind of no contest. For some of these, I'm like already thinking about stuff before, so it takes me a second. Kyle Lowry or Ben Simmons? Definitely. Yeah, actually... I don't know. I might have to take Ben Simmons. Especially if I'm building a franchise, I'm definitely going to take Ben Simmons on that one. Would the Spurs have beat Golden State with Kawhi last year? I think they had a good chance. They, like, waxed them that first game, and that was at Golden State. So they could very well have beat them if Kawhi had stayed healthy, but now we will never know. Embiid or Chris Stapps? Um... Probably still Chris Stapps. And Bean's definitely on the way up. We got a new subscriber. Welcome to the squad. I got to get this pulled up so I can actually see where the uh, notifications are coming up. And I can see what your name is. All right. We're uh, still on the grind. It's amazing that you can play this over and over again and basically never run out of stamina. I'm definitely really glad that they fixed this since last season. Clay or Curry for threes? Uh, spot up shooter would be Clay. Off the dribble would be Curry. Best shooter, Curry or Corver? Cur Corver's not even in the conversation. What's up, Play Games Master? Welcome to the squad. Westbrook or Curry to Charlotte? If you're, are you saying if I had to choose, I'd probably take Curry. Who got better handles, Kyrie or Jamal Crawford? Uh, Jamal Crawford's handles have actually gotten a little bit loose. Definitely Kyrie. Ben Simmons or Embiid? I'm probably taking Embiid. 
You gonna get gameplay with the 92 LeBron? I might if you guys really want to see it. I mean, you guys can drop a like if you want to see that gameplay, but I figure there's already a gameplay out. I can still get it out to you guys if you want. Might try to snipe him off the auction house or something like that. Wilt or Jordan? I'm taking Jordan. MVP Rose or MVP Westbrook? I'm probably still taking MVP Westbrook. I think, and people hate when I say this, but MVP Rose was like slightly overrated. And I think people like to like remember him like, oh, D-Rose, what could have been? But if you look back, and obviously this is me looking back as like a stat sheet reader because I didn't watch the NBA a ton at that point in time. But I feel like he's slightly overrated. Like I people, I feel like there are other players in the league that had stats just as good at that point in time. Jokic or Teodosic? Definitely Jokic, but I think Milos, I think he could be a good player. Although he's already like 28 or 29 something. Or something. Gosh, I can't speak! How close are you to getting that 96 Harden? I still got a good ways to go. It'll be, it'll be a couple weeks. I'll probably end up using somebody else's account. A person butt cheek said my mom subscribed. I can't believe I just said that out loud. Thoughts on Tristan Thompson? I think he's way overpaid. Thanks for subscribing, Tito Gaming. Welcome to the squad. He's third. I'm trying to like this stupid pop filter is in the way. MVP Dirk or MVP Westbrook? That's tough for me to say because MVP Dirk was so long ago, and I wasn't like an avid NBA fan at that point in time. I was a Hornets fan more than, or not a Hornets fan, an NCAA fan more than I was an NBA fan. Um, Paul George for Kuzma or Ingram? If you said Kuzma and Ingram, maybe, but Paul George for Kuzma. Well, I guess they do have a lot more time. Paul George only has like one more year on his contract, doesn't he? Yeah, lots of tokens on that one. Harden or Antetokounmpo for MVP? Based off like the past few weeks, I'm going to take Antetokounmpo. Uh, if you look at the entire season, probably Harden, but... Harden's been struggling the last few games, and he's injured right now. Ray Allen or Stephen Curry? I think if you look at both at the end of their careers, people are going to say no contest Stephen Curry. But right now, people can still make the argument for Ray Allen simply because of the fact that he has more total three-pointers, even though Steph Curry's like a much better, in all facets of the game, three-point shooter. Like, he's way better off the dribble. Maybe not as good catch and shoot, but I'd say overall, Steph Curry's still the better shooter. LeBron James or Kevin Durant for finals MVP? I mean, last year, definitely Durant. I don't think there's really anybody that would say Durant didn't deserve finals MVP last year. Best starting five of all time. I mean, it would be hard to argue against the current Warriors starting five just because they're so nasty. Who's better, Kawhi or LeBron? Beast Stopper, I know you're not going to be happy about this one, but LeBron's the best player in the NBA right now. He's going to be the best player in the NBA probably for a little bit longer. So you're going to have to give your boy Kawhi a couple more years to get Durant and uh, to get Durant and LeBron out of the way. LeBron averaged a triple-double, except he didn't. Not this year, anyway. Um, best player of TMC? I don't know what that stands for. Who's the best leader, LeBron or Jordan? I would say LeBron's probably a better leader than Jordan. Although, at, at the same time, LeBron really, really likes to pass blame off to others. Unless he deserves... Unless it's positive. Then he takes all the credit, but... Yes, Just Savage, I can hit you with the mod. Woo, I literally asked you to join me for the live stream, and you just went upstairs. Like, I wanted this to be a live stream where we did a Q&A together, and you just went upstairs for no reason to do nothing. So I don't feel bad about not talking. That's your fault. Who's better, Prime Kareem or Prime Bill? Bill who? You gotta, you gotta give me a last name on that one. There are lots of bills. Kobe 8 versus Kobe 24. Um. Oh my gosh, that's tough. I believe Kobe won MVP in his 24 years. Um. When I heard Kobe talk about Kobe 28 versus. Or Kobe 24 versus Kobe 8, I think he said Kobe 24 just because it was so much harder. Uh, because he got older, and when you get old, 
your body starts to hurt, especially when you play in the NBA against all these 20-year-olds that are full of energy and everything. So, if Kobe says Kobe 24, then I'm going to say Kobe 24 as well. Woo! I said if you live stream with me, then we can go out after. And you are currently not live streaming with me. So, like, it's a two-way street, buddy. Can you say three players from Serbia? I can. Milos Theodosic, Nikola Jokic. Can I say pass players? Can I say Vladi Divac? If I come down, will we go out? Yes, but I don't know if you're going to come down. Freestyle street basketball too. I don't even know what that is. Welcome, Anomaly to the squad. Thanks for subscribing. LeBron to Houston. I don't see that happening. Heat LeBron or Cavs LeBron? Well, I'm taking Heat or uh, Cavs LeBron. Like modern Cavs LeBron, not old Cavs LeBron. If you come down here and annoy me, then we're not going out. Okay, Capiche? Are you like actually going to join the live stream? And that's my roommate, Giannis, future GOAT. I would say so. Dude's got a lot of potential. Bobby, what you talking about? What you talking about? All right. Is Wu going to make it into the picture? Oh my goodness, you're like going to knock over my computer. Okay, is Wu? Is Wu in it? Okay, there we go. You got to... I don't know if you're going to be able to make it in. Okay. There. Yeah. Hey, welcome Christian Spin to the squad. Scoot over a little. No. <laughs> All right. Questions for Wu. This is my roommate. Fire away. Grandmaster Wu. <laughs> Freestyle street basketball is a 3v3 game. Is that something that's like currently being developed? I got Trey Young for a draft number one. Oh, did draft. Oh, Trae yeah. Young. I would say Trey Young. Trey Young and Marvin Bagley for sure. Who do I think is the most athletic rookie? Not Bobby. Donovan Mitchell. Definitely the most athletic in Bobby. No, Ben Simmons. Donovan. He's not the most athletic. Oh, have you seen him play? Yes, I've seen him play. Have you I seen think Donovan, Donovan Mitchell, Mitchell play? Mitchell gets a lot of hype. Have you seen him play? Have you seen his dunks? Have... How can you say he's not the most because athletic rookie? Because he's because like... <sighs> Nobody else can dunk like that. But Ben carries his team. That doesn't have to do with athleticism. They're not asking who's the better rookie. Who They're asking who's the best rookie. Or, no. They're asking who's the most athletic rookie. They play a different role. I know, but you gotta answer the question. They ask who's the most athletic rookie. Not Bobby. And it's definitely Donovan Mitchell. It's not even close. Who do I got for <laughs> rookie of the year? Probably right now, Ben Simmons. Honestly, Malik Monk's a pretty freaking athletic rookie. Most people just don't realize because he hasn't played all that much. Bobby is woo annoying, yes. Yep, for sure. Especially when he wants to be. No whispering in the microphone, you sneaky <laughs> snake. Thanks for subscribing, NBA fanboy. Welcome to the squad. What are you playing in the background? This is, I'm auto playing because I'm grinding for grinding for 96 Harden. We gotta have like a thousand NBA Live Mobile quarters played, and NBA Live Mobile has a feature where it auto plays for you. So I'm just auto playing the quarters. <laughs> Lonzo will win 20 championships. Get out of here. That is nonsense, guys. You need to ask Wu questions. That's why Wu is here. Give us a secret of Bobby's. Use discretion. Give us what? Give us a secret of Bobby's. Use discretion. He's dirty. I yes, I'm very messy. He's lazy. I'm not lazy. He's he's shy. I'm kind of shy. Can't talk to girls. Yeah, I can't talk to girls. Oh, there we go. I can list more. Bobby's Bobby secrets. Yeah. He wanted discretion. We gotta yeah. If you uh if we get the stream up to 250 likes, then maybe we'll get more secrets. Is Bobby depressed? Sometimes. <laughs> What am I depressed? When I don't hang out with you. No, Bobby does not no, have a you're depressed when I don't hang out with you. It doesn't go the other way around. No. I could live by myself in a cave and I would be fine. Five years in Booker or Mitchell. I like Devin Booker. I think he's in a sucky team. Yeah, that should be a close one. Mitchell's in a good system. Like mediocre. Mitchell's system. in a good system. Mediocre system. Yeah, I'm about to say. Yeah. 
Will the Lakers have a better future than their past? No. No. No, no way. you can't beat that. You no. can't beat Kobe. I mean, unless we get some sort of unless Lonzo Kobe-like is... or Magic-like player, I don't unless, see it happening. Unless, unless LaVar was actually right. Yeah, yeah LaVar's not right. You can't autoplay all day. You can't make 10,000 hey, points autoplay. Can we track your package from Big Ballers? No, they haven't sent me the new tracking number. And I sent them an email, and they won't email me back. I know, I'm mad. I said, are y'all just gonna... Y'all just wanna refund me, or... Oh my gosh. We just dropped 19 points on autoplay. What? Is this for real? I got a screenshot of that. That is crazy. No, they, they need to add a box score. 19 points on autoplay. That's got to be some kind of record. Okay. fix the glitch or you can't reach it. Okay. Before you get stuck. Okay, you can't ask us Bobby or Wu. How are, how are we supposed to choose between ourselves? Like, what? Okay. Okay, let I me pick, get that. I pick Wu. Well, obviously. Who is the best rookie this season? Simmons, dog. No Why was you even... Lonzo is not even in the discussion for best rookie. Bobby is definitely... If he didn't have to talk to anyone, he wouldn't. That's, like, if he could survive on his own, that's very true. he would. Yep. I'm... Like, I'm comfortable talking to people that I know well. But I hate talking to people that I don't know. <laughs> you need to drink some water. Though. I do need to drink some water. Wait, why do you say that? Yeah, I am chapping. You want to give me some water? No. Please! I'll take over. I am not athletic. Who are you athletic? <laughs> I am not athletic. Dupe. I got the Asian. Who, I got the Asian who grew up playing Pokemon and Ping Pong? And that sounds like a stereotype, but that is true. <laughs> Oh, Pazingas or Oladipo? Pazingas, Okay, yo. Woo, as a Sixers fan, Embiid or Simmons? I'm going for M Simmons to carry the team. I'm going for Embiid to hype up the media. I think Embiid's the better player. Maybe, he might not be in the future, but right now Embiid's definitely the no, better player. I think in the future, Where? Ben Simmons will be definitely the I know, I just said he's going to be better in the oh, future. Oh, I think you said Embiid. No. The other roommate is at work right now. 5,000 likes and we'll get all the roommates together for Starting one live Starting five stream. rookie lineup. Hmm. Ooh. Okay, I'll so take point Markel, guard. Or Markel for the point no! guard. No! Ben Simmons for two. Oh, wait. The ben Simmons two. is your point guard. What are you talking about? Markel for two, one. Malik Mo for two. Ben, ben Simmons for three. I don't know a four rookie. Did Mitchell? you just say Malik Monk for two? Yeah. Why? Yeah. I wouldn't even put Malik Monk at two. <laughs> Who's a good shooting guard for a rookie season? Uh, Donovan Mitchell? He's a, he's a two? Yes! He's more of a three. I'm almost positive Donovan Mitchell is a two. Let's see. Donovan Mitchell. I mean, they're interchangeable, but I feel like he's not a three. I'm almost positive he's a two. Yeah, he's... He's six foot three. Oh my gosh, the game keeps crashing. I'm pretty much positive that Donovan Mitchell is a two. Three I things think... we don't know about Wu. Well, you don't know much about Wu, so this would be pretty easy. Oh, it's not my channel, dog. Uh, well, yeah, that's, I like, why, that's I like, why I said it'd be easy. I like coffee. Hey, 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 hey. I, like I get to do three I like things. Coffee. I'm, I'm a, still doing three I'm things. I'm a barista, barista, and I hate... I hate... Uh... Xbox. Why do you hate Xbox? PS4 is better. You don't even have a PS4! I did. But I you don't! It. I sold it because I need it. Yeah, that's what I thought. I didn't have room. Let's see. Steven Adams or Jokic? Three things you don't Steven know Adams. about Wu. Number one, Wu. Do you still play Pokemon? Uh, about the latest one that was playing. Wu kind of still plays Pokemon. Because it's only. Number two. Wu is a bandwagon Sixers fan. No, I'm not. <laughs> you can say that when uh, they actually won a championship. Okay. Uh, number three, Wu is actually from South Korea. Who's the best rookie of the season? We've had this discussion like 20 times. Lou William is an all-star. Yeah. Lou Williams could be an all-star. He shoots like He's all averaging like 25 points a game. Dude is going off. Now, I'm not sure he deserves an all-star more than like Devin Booker or somebody else like that. But Devin Booker is definitely. I think he'd be an all-star in the East, for sure. Prime Mello or Prime T-Mac? I'm probably going to take Prime T-Mac on that one. Allen Iverson or Ray Allen? 
Allen Iverson, definitely. LeBron is not the king. Okay, if LeBron's not the king, then who's the king? You gotta give us someone else. Bosh or Leonard to Charlotte? You know Chris Bosh isn't in the NBA anymore, you right? Talk, <laughs> yeah, Chris Bosh isn't in the NBA. He's still getting he's still getting money from the Heat because he has contracts. South Korea makes great movies. <laughs> I mean, great like independent films. But... Did Wu play Pokemon Go? I did. Yes, we actually. So Wu and I met at a summer project like two summers ago, and we actually played Pokemon Go together. That was back when all Wu did was annoy me. No, I barely knew you, dog. That's right, yep. That's you, d- you didn't annoy me as much at that point in time. You were just mean to me all the time. Antetokounmpo. Mm-hmm. Porzingis or Antetokounmpo? Definitely Giannis. No, I'll take Porzingis. Wu, no, did you I... watch Train to Busan? No, do I don't you... watch Train. Do you know Samtan in South Korea? Samsung Tower? I don't know. No, Is that... Dog. Okay. Durant is the king? That's questionable. That's highly questionable. Brandon Ingram or Julius Randle? Brandon Ingram. That's like, Julius Randle is about to get traded away in a heartbeat. Do I watch Arrow? I did. I tried to watch it and I just couldn't get into it. The acting in that is really, really bad. Like, eh. anything on the CW automatically has really bad acting. Durant can be the king of the snakes. <laughs> I would agree with that one. How old is Durant? Durant is better than LeBron. Unpopular opinions in the chat right now. Uh-huh. Warriors are trash. Okay, that's just straight up wrong. They have the best league or uh, best. What? Oh my gosh, best record in the NBA. I couldn't think of that word to save my, save my life. Woo! They want you to sing. I don't sing. Woo! Sing. Steve Kerr, Greg. Greg, who's Greg? Greg Popovich. Greg Popovich for sure. Yeah. Who needs a card in NBA Live Mobile? I I'm agree. I'm telling you, whoever made Bobby's card made me one. That was pretty sick. I'm trying to remember who made those cards. I think it was, uh, it was either Jonicide or Chino. I think it was Jonicide. I'd probably be like 72. And Bobby would be a 99. Be like... Coach of the year. Oh. Uh, Brett, Brett Brown. Brett Brown. Who does he coach? Probably the Sixers? Yeah, that's what I thought. Definitely not Steve Clifford. Steve Clifford needs to find a job somewhere else. Are you pumped for the new Battle Royale games to mobile? Yes. I've been enjoying them. I'm looking forward to see to seeing what PUBG Mobile looks like. I do agree that Houston is better than the Warriors. Houston, no. But they would not, Definitely not right now. They would not beat the Warriors because they finished the Warriors. Mm-mm. I mean, not right now, but like if they had Ooh. a healthy squad. Ooh, they said Brett greater than Wu. Yo, I'm a uh, um, modern. And he said, <laughs> I, he called me, he called me Rice Gum. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the same guy. What's my PSN? I actually don't have PlayStation. I got Xbox. This is tiring, y'all. I don't know how you do this. Thanks for subscribing, Austin Thrust Vlogs. Jeez. Kobe Prime or LeBron Prime? Kobe. Nah, LeBron. Well, uh, LeBron's still in his prime. But he yeah, I don't know if. It's hard to define LeBron's prime because I think he's past his scoring prime, but I think like basketball ability prime, he's still in his prime. I think he was in his prime when he was in the Heat. I think he was in his scoring prime on the Heat. Thank you. Yeah. I remember watching them play. I was low key a Heat fan when because of the bandwagon. But I didn't know anything about the NBA dog. Bad. That's like definition. That's why the Warriors have so many fans. Because they're good, and they're in California, and they yeah. have Steph Curry. I saw this little kid, this, like, 10-year-old, walking into the Steph Curry, like, the new ones. And, like, like the stance, like, warrior socks with, like, uh-huh. white gym shorts and, uh, like, Steph Curry SC yeah. shirt. I was like, that is the definition of Steph Curry culture. That is, yep, that's... The people that are Steph Curry fans are all the way Steph Curry fans. Welcome, Mahad Tala to the squad, I Del think was Curry your name. Curry or LeBron I mean, Del- what? Del Curry. One actually played in the league. One, is, one, one's really good at one talking. Game. Yeah. Bobby is Steph a bandwagon? What does? The- How can you be a bandwagon? You Bobby, can't be an NBA player and be a bandwagon. I think he's saying Bobby or Steph is Bobby a bandwagon? I think the answer. Is- no, you don't know Jack Squad about bandwagons. You're a bandwagon. Do you like Kyrie Irving? I don't as much. Um, I think he's a little bit overrated, but he's a good player. 
He's he's not as overrated this season as he was last season. I mean, like I'm Kyrie Irving, I'm playing with LeBron and Cavs. I'm, I guess I was salty that I didn't win a championship this year, but like I get to play with the best player. Mm-hmm. I don't want to be a main man. I don't want to be a second. I mean, but I guess if I were that, position. but I don't know, man. He was dramatic. But why is he doing two different teams? Yeah, I think I think he could have gone about it in a better way. I'm honestly surprised that after everything Durant has gone through, the way that Kyrie left the Cavs, they haven't like given him really any crap about it. Like nobody calls Kyrie a snake, even though he like left out of the blue when his contract wasn't even up. Everybody had a good feeling that Durant was gonna leave because his contract was up, and he was obviously talking to other teams, and yet he gets like way more crap than anybody else. Well, like KD is so much better than Kyrie. Yeah, that but still, people... Plus, but, like, Kyrie wanted to be his own man. But, yeah. like, KD joined a super team. But why does it make a difference? Because, like, Ky- Kyrie wanted to be his own man. He didn't care where he really wanted. He could have gone to the Celtics. But I mean, when it comes Celtics. to how you went about doing it, Kyrie was more of a snake. Yes. Yes. But... Yeah. Mm-hmm. But like KD, he he obviously played with Russ and didn't like the franchise, so he did it on his own instead of. I think that Kyrie was more of a snake, and Durant was more of a coward. I think that's the best way to define it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. They're both snakes. Isaiah doesn't want to be in Cleveland. I, I think he does. I don't think he does. I think I mean, he wants no. to be back in the Celtics. Like, do you see him whenever they played the? When the Cavs played the Celtics, he looked so happy to see all of his old teammates. You don't ever really see him that happy with the Cavs. I mean, I'm, I mean, like, he's playing with the Browns. Like, if I'm, if I'm a player in the league, I'm, I'm a player. In the I mean, yeah. yeah. Make, make, oh, I don't even, he retracted his message. Is Zaza the dirtiest player in the NBA? Zaza is the most trash player. <laughs> Yeah, like, I don't know that he's the dirtiest. He can't, they can't afford any good centers. That's why they have him. Yeah. Honestly, I don't even know why he's a starting guy over mm-hmm. um, DeVille. Looks like the comment section agrees Isaiah would rather be a Celtic. I would, like, I, I get it. That's where he... That's where he became a star. That's where the city that actually gave him a chance. Because there were other teams that he played for that he was playing well for, and they just wouldn't give him a chance because he was so small. Sacramento, Sacramento Kings. I think the I think he played for the Suns as well. We actually lost that quarter. That's unusual. Um. So yeah, I don't blame him for wanting to be a Celtic. The city loves him, even though he's not even there anymore. Chris Paul doesn't want to be in Houston. No. I would disagree with that one. I think Chris Paul doesn't want to be in the Clippers. Yeah, he didn't want to be on the Clippers. That's why he went to Houston. Clippers is... I don't... But it's surprisingly they're keeping up. Yeah, I didn't... I'm going to be honest. I didn't think that Chris Paul on the Clippers would work nearly as well as it had. But when the Clippers have James Harden healthy, Chris Paul healthy, and Clint Capella healthy, they're 15-0. and 0. Like, that is crazy. The thing is, they can't keep all of them healthy. So when it's... I think when it's uh, when it's Harden and Chris Paul, they're like 16 and two or something like that. And then with only Harden or only Paul, it's a different record. But the when NBA they it's rigged. I, I you would have a hard time proving it. Like there's not a lot of I mean it's not rigged, but it's it. very like the best wins in the well yeah, but that's more that's more just unbalanced than it is rigged. Top five dunkers of all time. All right, you got to give me like in-game dunkers or dunk contest dunkers. But dunking is so arbitrary. Well, yeah, you got to look at. Dunking is all about athleticism instead of like. It's more. It's easier to determine if they say dunk contest dunkers because it, then it comes down to athleticism and creativity, as opposed to if you say in-game dunkers because then it comes down to like strength and athleticism. So if you're strong and athletic, then you can posterize people. And that's what's considered a good dunk, like, in-game. But when it comes to dunk contest dunks, the reason Zach Levine and Aaron Gordon can be great is because they're crazy athletic but also really creative. But they would never do any of those dunks, like, in a game. What's your dream car? My dream car used to be the Porsche. Which one? Uh, Yeah, that used to be my dream car, too. But now it's like... Porsche. Porsche SUV. But like, why? You, this, this to carry your kids around in? No, but it's like. I don't know why else you'd want a Porsche SUV. Because it's SUV. 
But like, this is I I don't have a drink card because I can't have a drink. Because <laughs> like you say, if you ask me if I want a drink card, I'll think of five cars I want that I can't decide. I guess. Mi name the five cars. Tesla. Porsche. Are you gonna name like any specific models or just like well, the brands? whatever the newest okay. model of Tesla is? I don't okay. know if they came up with the new one. Hey, oh, no, 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 Porsche Spider is one of the hybrid ones. Mm -hmm. And then a, a, a pimped out Toyota Prius. <laughs> and then a, a pimped out Escalade. And a pimped out Toyota Prius. And then like a. Oh. I don't, know. I don't have like a. I don't have a obsession with like fancy cars. I just have an obsession with like good cars. With p particular cars. Yeah. BMWs. Yeah, I mean they're good, but like if I could have any car. If we if we ever got a Prius, we would never live. Let, I had a let Prius. Him live it down, My mom had a but Prius. But he would still drive it anyways. Dude, that thing took me to the beach in one tank. Did I see LeBron or did I see Sabonis doing LeBron dirty with the spin move and then the dunk yesterday? That was that was so funny because as soon as it happened, LeBron just turned around and looked for the nearest person that he needed to blame for getting dunked on. <laughs> oh, that was so funny. Okay, my name is Wu. And it's spelled W O O. W O O. Yes, it is not W U. Do you think Thomas will ever dunk in the game? Uh, unless it's like a wide open. Yeah, it would have to be like a wide open fast break. Who you got, J R Smith or Lou Williams? That's no contest, Lou Williams. Lou Williams, dog. Not Jared even close. Old. All J R Smith was take bad three point attempts. Honestly, they, need, they if they need any capital, they should trade away J R. Uh, yeah, I would agree. Is with Shumpert that. traded? No, Shumpert's injured right now. Oh. Mm -hmm. Shump they should trade him to Shumpert and JR. Well, he's going to have two. Yeah, I don't know. The funny thing is, when Ty they Cole. traded, they got Shumpert and JR. I'm not sure if they got anybody else in that deal, but they both came from the nice. Knicks. Yeah. Okay, they asked who's your top f top three favorite NBA teams? Sixers. Rockets. And I want to say Suns. Just because of Devin Booker. You really like Devin Booker that much? I think he's a baller, dog. He is a baller. He's like a 20-year-old baller. He yeah. drops like 50 points. Yeah, he's definitely a baller. I'm not going to argue about that. I just like, I hate franchise players. I hate the players that stay in one franchise for Why? That's because, loyalty. Like, That's loyalty. Some teams don't have the ability to turn around the franchise. Like the Hornets. Kemba is a great player. They've developed him well. And he's gotten... He came from a good college career to an NBA career that's decent, that he's gotten growth. He's, he's grown, but like, Hornets doesn't know how to build around him, so I feel bad for him. The Hornets definitely need to rebuild. It's time for them to realize and just go ahead and tank. And I'm fine with that, because I'm not going to, wait, when am I, I think I'm actually going to a Hornets game in like a week. Is that, I think it's the 22nd or 23rd? The trade. You got invited. You just didn't accept. What? Yes, against the Pelicans. I did say yeah. Uh, did you tell Trey that? No. Yeah, you probably I did. told Trey that. I mean, you can go back and look at the messages. We already bought tickets. Uh, yeah. Well, you probably day, have work. What day is it? Uh, Monday? Read my chat, Claire Harden. Obviously Harden. No contest. Was Cavs dumb for trading? Um, they got, who did they get for? I think they got, did they get Anthony Bennett? Was that that draft? I feel like it was. I can't remember though. Damien. Uh, Damian Lillard and Kemba Walker are in the same mediocre franchise player boat that Wu's talking about. I think Damien is a lot better than Kemba. Yeah, I think he's better and he's got better players around him as yeah, well. Yeah, Kemba is just like, yeah. I don't know. Hey, we got promoted. Moving up in the leagues. We're up to, uh, what is this, Pro 2? All right, so we get 375 fans every time we win, and I think we get more rep as well. Whenever I started this, I only have 5,000 fans, so making our way up. Let's see. I'm trying to figure out when this Hornets game is that I'm going to. Is it blue chip? I mean, is it ugly? They got Kevin Love for Wiggins. That's not terrible. I think Wiggins definitely hasn't played up to his potential, so. But I think the team. Oh, Timberwolves is also one of those teams that I like. No, they look great on Yeah. But it's like, I'm not against 
a lot of teams. I think they're except the Hornets. Except even though the Hornets. they're your hometown team. I'm not against Hornets. I just think they're trash. You're trash. But anyone but but Cavs and Warriors. I'm okay. One twenty four is when the Hornets play the Pelicans. Let me see. That's when that's eleven days. Okay, so that's Wednesday. Yep. Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Do I have a method of getting blocks faster? Auto play a lot. Do Question you see go KD going back to OKC? Mm, no, no, he would never go back to. OKC. Unless like Russ leaves, he would get destroyed if he went back to OKC. They would never. They wouldn't want him back. Question for Wu. So are you telling me that you hate Iverson because he was loyal and stayed with the Sixers? I didn't say that. You I'm said you hate players that stay with one franchise their whole career. If if my franchise rewards me very well, I'm going to stay. But if they suck at drafting picks like they picked Kaminsky over Devin Booker, I'm leaving. No loyalty. I need a good team. If no I'm gonna loyalty! If I'm going to work for a company, I need to know that that company's got my back. Why? Because I think I'm, that's like a Korean thing. Like I, I, whenever I took Japanese business culture, like I learned, like if I'm Kemba, when somebody works for a company in Japan, they work there their whole lives. I think that's where that comes. If from. I'm Kemba, I want to be traded because the Hornets are no longer working. They picked Kaminsky over Becker, and they picked all Chapel Hill players, big white dudes. They don't pick Chapel Hill players anymore. They got Tyler Hansborough in a draft. I don't even know if they... I don't think they even drafted him. I think the Pacers drafted Tyler Hansborough. Did. And they just acquired him in a trade because they knew Carolina fans would come to the games if they got Tyler Hans How did Tyler Ulysses... We lost 05 in an autoplay quarter. What is that? Goodness. Do I think Steve Kerr was good on the Bulls? He's he pretty good. He was clutch. He got some championships. Shot some three-pointers. That's what they needed him to do. Didn't he fight with him, dude? I think, yeah, I think too many games. What is this? I think they're in practice. And they yeah, I'm pretty sure they did get into a fight. I gotta respect that. Yeah, you gotta respect him for that. Wait, Kemba for... Do, you think, do you think DeAndre Jordan would feel, fit well into Cavs? Um, That's think, too much talent, though. Why is it too much? I mean, the thing is, it's not that much talent because most of the talent is super old. D-Wade is mega old. LeBron's getting old. I'm Kevin Love's get getting old. You sound like your grandpa. How do I sound like your grandpa? Oh, yeah, dry mouth. Okay, I know what you mean. Can you mod me? No, I don't recognize you. But thank you for watching the vids. I appreciate it. Talking, stop talking NBA. The Warriors are going to win this year. Why does that mean we have to stop talking NBA? Yeah, I'm pretty disappointed in Michigan State, too. They did not play well today at all. They have a major turnover problem, and it drives me crazy. D Wade's probably pretty overrated. Considering the fact that he's in all star voting contention, I'd say he's overrated. I don't think people have realized how old he's gotten. Uh, personally, I think Kemba could get traded for like half a bag of salty and crackers. Yeah, you're wrong. Hey, no worries, little squirt. I appreciate you joining the stream. Can I be mod? No, Ryan Wheeler, I recognize you, but not well enough to give you mod. Do you have any tips on going on dates? <laughs> hey, alright guys, you gotta you gotta give Wu dating advice for tomorrow. He's got a date. You guys got the dub tonight? Yeah, dog. Eagles, yeah. Wu's a bandwagon Eagles fan too. I am. I'm a Philadelphia sports fan. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. How is D-Wade overrated? He scores he's not... 12 points a game and he's in all-star voting contention. I mean... That's just kind of like legacy. Like, okay, like, all time. Kobe, he, Kobe. Oh, okay, all time he's not overrated, but right now he's overrated. Kobe, like, he was in the All Star game until his retirement. He didn't. But that was different. He was still dropping like 20 a game. No, he was barely. I mean, not like. Like, he was ball hogging and dropping 20 a game, but he was still dropping 20. Yeah, you can't ball ah, hog. Gosh, you're... dang it. Goaltending. D Wade is the third best shooting guard of all time. Who's the first two then? Key Nation. Well, obviously the top two are gonna be Jordan and Kobe. Um, are we saying? Are we saying? Are you saying D Wade over Iverson? Oof, dog, you you insulting my. That's that's a tough one. That's definitely a tough one. We'll make sure the. Okay, yeah. That's pretty, <laughs> that's pretty wise. I appreciate that. Good good advice, man. I mean, that wouldn't be the worst thing, like. 
When you're married, Woo. When you're married. No, like, like. Oh, like kids right now? Like, I'm not, like, obviously I'm, like, 22 and I'm in college. I don't want Woo. If you started dating an 18-year-old that had kids. No, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Big like, red flag. Right now in the age, age range, it's a big red flag. But, like, when I'm older, maybe, like, that's not the worst thing. Is it? I'm going to have to go start auto-playing season games because I have too many head-to-head -head games going right now. That's funny. All right. We'll go ahead and resume that. Oh. No need for that. Put user in timeout. Clay time. What about Clay time? Booker better than Wade. Well, right now, yeah. Booker's been like not even close. Kemba's not in his prime. I think he's like around his prime. I think if he stays, he's good. Okay, guys, Nightbot is not a scam. That's something I set up. Those are all reliable links. That's not a scam. <laughs> Okay, so if Kemba stays, she's gonna be all time, all time bonus. Player. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's. I mean, I think he's probably already an all time bonus franchise player. I found Kemba. You gotta think about it. Do I want to leave a legacy or do I want money and change? The thing is, he's he's not gonna leave a legacy if he just stays there and takes L's on L's on L's. Like I think he, for the good of the team, I think he needs to get traded. KD greater than LeBron. I think he's a better scorer. Oh, he's not even the most paid player in the ownership. Who is? Um, Batum and... Oh, that's right. We paid Batum way, way more. MKG. Yeah. Yeah, we paid them way more. So, like, he's much. a very, like, solid asset. Yeah. Who do I think is the best player this season? Uh, like I've said, probably top three are Giannis, LeBron, and Harden. Woo, how do you feel about Bobby's success on YouTube? I get some of his benefits, <laughs> but not a lot. He's a very, he's a very, like, he's successful, but he's still small. Uh -huh. I'm not saying he's not big. I'm not, I'm not getting front row tickets to Hornets games or anything. Yeah, he's not getting sponsorship deals left and right. I mean, like, I'm happy for him. Definitely something you know. If you know him, you love. Woo, Woo actually didn't know that I had a YouTube channel until he had already known me for I like the video of him six video. or seven months. He used to be in a little corner of his room. <laughs> hey, Mama Bucket's in the chat. Thanks for joining. Does the dude in the back like shoes? I like shoes. I mean, like, I have more sh sh game. Um, game. What is it? Shoe game, game than Drake, Bobby. Yeah. I, spend more I yeah, I think if I spent more, then it would be more of a contest. But I just hate spending money. It's just like it's hard for me to justify buying shoes when I've already got shoes that fit. Well, I mean, recently I've got. But shoes. but I'm I'm still gonna yeah. He's also got a friend that his dad his friend's dad works at Adidas, so he gets fifty percent off shoes, which is an unfair advantage. Well, like I don't have shoe game compared to like social media shoe game because like those dudes like. I'm not going out there and, and copying the James that the day first day came out. Yeah. I have shoe game relatively like clean shoe. Uh, there's a good chance that I'm going to get those new Westbrooks whenever they drop on Monday. What is it? 10 a.m.? I think we said. Favorite team. Sixers. His is the Sixers, mine's the Hornets. <laughs> Am I. St <laughs> What's my Drake favorite Lee? Jews? A Jordans? A AJ Ones? Uh, and I, I don't really have a favorite Jordan. I don't keep up with Jordans all that much. Not a huge Jordan fan. Actually, well, I guess I'll say my favorite Jordans are the new Westbrooks. <laughs> Change the song. Do we have a song? Why you, why you not like the song? Take it. Okay. I mean, we can change it. Mama Buckets, who makes everything around her really positive? Yes, my, oh, Mama Buckets makes everything around her. Harden would not be MVP because he yes. disappears. Now. Well, when you're when you're, it's because before player. he was like carrying the team the entire time. Yeah. That's like saying Westbrook disappeared in the playoffs yet last year. Like, yeah, he didn't have a great playoffs, but he carried the team for the entire season. Give her chocolate and Maverick merch. I would never support that man. <laughs> Give her Maverick merch. I cannot believe you just said that. Oh my gosh. 
give her Maverick merch. I do like the Wizards too. I think so. Now we're getting all the Drake jokes down in the comments. Are you Jamie still Lynn's, dating Rihanna? When's your next album? Jamie Lynn's the Warriors. Um, they can't afford it. <laughs> like in the term. I mean, I don't know. Tricky, I don't know why he would go to the Warriors because they've already got Stephen Livingston. <laughs> Top three favorite players in the NBA: Kemba. Giannis and Steph. Those are my top three. Ben Simmons. Joel B. JJ Reddick. <laughs> Bruh, you gotta be joking. Devin Booker. You just listed Devin Booker as the reason that the Suns are in your top three favorite teams. Devin Booker. Yeah. Ben Simmons. Why do you like ben the Rockets? Me. Just because they're good? Harden. Why do you like Harden? Harden. 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 Dude, when I played the rock as a Rockets in the 2K, like Clint, 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 Clint gets all the. So it's all based off your 2K experiences. Yeah, gets all that the makes a little bit more sense. Woohoo! Free silver player. Oops, can't one. wait. Oh yeah. Oh, getting lots of tokens. D Rosen is also good. Like D Rosen. D Rosen. D Rosen. I don't have a lot of things against a lot. Except when you're KD. When you buy a jersey, it's <laughs> That's why you don't like KD. I hate him. Okay, so we were we went to New York City the summer when KD was in free agency. So it was like it's probably like June, early beginning of June. Wu buys a KD jersey from the NBA store for a hundred and ten dollars. Granted, I didn't know I barely knew anything about <laughs> NBA. And my friend bought a Russell Westbrook jersey, so I was like, you know what? We're best friends. Like, I'm gonna I'm a be his number two. To get a <laughs> and then a month later, KD gets traded, and the jersey's gotten, worth like, nothing. I should have gotten like. I didn't like the Hornets back then. Not, I didn't like the Sixers back then. Yeah, I think you were a OKC fan back then, weren't you? I mean, like, I wasn't going to get the, like, I should got a I don't think you were, like, a fan of a specific team at that point in time. I was a, yeah, I was a, yeah, high, all high beast. I should have gotten, like, a LeBron jersey. That would have been good. All-time Warriors versus all-time Bulls. That's a tough one. I didn't. I'm taking all-time Lakers over all of them. KD didn't get Yeah, you're right. KD didn't get traded. That was my bad. Didn't mean to say that. Kyrie over I Isaiah over Kyrie. I think Isaiah was only good because he was a franchise player. I would agree with that. <laughs> there is no way he's going to be able to continue to carry that team. Davis better than Porzingis. Heck yeah. Ah! He's a foot taller, dog. <laughs> no, he's not. They're both seven feet. Porzingis is four inches taller. Really? Yes. Porzingis is 7'3", Anthony Davis is 6'11". Porzingis is white, though. So, he can shoot the three ball. And he, I'm pretty sure he's averaging more blocks than Anthony Davis as well. And like, he gets injured less. Hmm. Best defensive rookie. That's a good one. Okay. Nobody really talks about how good these rookies are at defense. Now that you talk about it. Oh, Jordan yeah. Bell, maybe? Oh, I'm yeah. taking Jordan Bell. Oh, he's a, he's a phenomenal player. If he gets, like, any type of skill, he's going to be an absolute monster. But you know, right now, he's just, like, pure, raw athleticism. He's got, like, no skills. Wait, are you saying the Hornets could have Porzingis? Could they have had Porzingis? I bet you they probably could have. So you're telling me they could have... Nobody thought Por No, no, Porzingis went mega early. That's why Knicks fans were upset about it. And also, just about, like, even Knicks fans thought Porzingis was going to be bad. I wouldn't feel bad about that. Bobby Bobby or Wu? I'm definitely taking Bobby in that matchup. Yeah, there's some Hornets, but after. So Jordan Bell did get drafted, but he was traded for cash considerations. He was drafted by the Bulls, and they traded him for <laughs> I think they traded him for, like, 900k or something like that. He did, he had some, like, six, like, he... He made a sign. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do I like Laurie Markinen? Yeah, I'd say he's one of the more underrated rookies in the league. I was texting you the other day about the Bulls. I'm saying, I looked at the roster and mm -hmm. have no experience. Yeah, they've got... Okay, so part of their issue at the beginning of the season was one of their best players was Zach Levine, and he was injured for a good bit. And two other players that mediocre got the fight. Yeah, Bobby Portis and Nikola Miritich. I think it's Nikola. Yeah. Yes? Okay. 
He's Miritich, I think, has actually been playing pretty well tonight. Yeah, yeah he's playing the best. This year, not tonight. But he's... Yes, we Top five... I've got my top four rookies. Um, Simmons. Simmons, Simmons, Simmons. Simmons. No, Simmons, Tatum, Kuzma, Mitchell. If I had to pick a fifth... Maybe Lonzo. I don't know. Who else Who else would I have Shoot up there? JaVel will start over Zaza. I, yeah, I think JaVel should start over Zaza, but for some reason, he never does. It's interesting. Raptors versus Warriors tonight. Should be a good game. It should be interesting. Let me get this refreshed. 234 likes on the stream. Can we get it up to... Let's see. Let's get it up to uh, 250 real quick. Get us up to 250. Let me pull the comments back up. Ben Simmons or Jason Tatum? Simmons. Do I think LaMelo will make the NBA? I think there's like a small chance he'll make the NBA, but I don't think he's going to have an impact anywhere. Wait, wait. LaMelo's the youngest one. CJ Williams is the most underrated rookie. Who's CJ Williams? I'm going to be honest, I don't even know who he plays for. Wait. I'm guessing he plays for like the Magic or... LaMelo will make the uh, NBA. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't even know who's CJ Williams. I think he's just... Uh, I don't know. Favorite in the Two Hype House is definitely Jesser, but I watch all their videos. Too Hype? That, uh, That's group? who I was watching earlier. Fanboy. Well, you're a cool. Unbox Therapy fanboy. No. Yo, huh? No, just... You watch the dude's music! You're cool. the only person that even knows that he makes music. Fanboy. Ah! Gordon Hayward also. Come on. No, he. Come on, no, they're the making a bad joke. The voting is this week. They're making a bad joke. Donovan Mitchell said, no, they should be banned. It's, I think it's a fair comparison. I don't think that I you think, could make like, a think, good argument for that. I think though. the Jazz has like 30 year olds, pretty old people, old dudes. They can pass in the ball and just be like, oh, just dunk on I don't think that much of it has to do with the system that he's in, though. Well, like Ben Simmons, he's gonna have to, he's been, he has to be carrying his team. He's not carrying his team, and Embiid's carrying the team. No. Yes! Embiid's getting out every other game. What? No. No, Simmons is not carrying that team. So JJ Redick is carrying that team. Yeah, because like they're just picking it up. Mm -hmm. What ball brother is going to have the best future? Obviously Lonzo. Lonzo. He's already made it. Yeah. He's a starting franchise player. Leangelo won't make the NBA, and Lamelo, if he does make the NBA, will not be good. Oh I my think Lamelo Le hasn't put that show. Like he doesn't have any athleticism. He's no, but he's he sixteen can't shoot. though. No, he's not. He's 18 or 19. No, look at his age. Leangelo. Oh, Leangelo. No, he's not making Did it. Did you say Lamelo? Lamelo is making to the NBA. He's, he's got Lamelo might. But he's he makes really bad decisions. Like, and he's shots. got a really busted shot, just like his brother. But it's busted in a different way. It's not the same busted shot. How many master tokens do I have? Ah, 20, 21, somewhere around there. Kyle Lowry or J.R. Smith? Is that a question? Kyle Lowry. Uh, who has been the best center this season so far? Boogie? As much as oh, as much as I hate this man, uh -huh. Cantor. Cantor? No, he hasn't. <laughs> what are man. you talking about? Okay, I, I just I love Cantor, but he's nowhere close I to the best. I just said I don't have much people that I have against him in the NBA. Uh, I hate Cantor. Why would you say he's the best center in the NBA? Oh, you know who's been the best center in the NBA? Who? Embiid? Oh, yeah. Uh, he's been good, but he's not better than Cousins. Cousins is definitely the best center in the NBA. Kemba, Courtney Lee, Michael Beasley, Porzingad, and Ennis. Agree? I don't know what you're asking if I agree with. Kemba or John Wall? Probably John Wall, although he's having a pretty bad season as well. Uh, the way that they just spelled Ennis characters. <laughs> Is Ben Simmons a real rookie? Probably not, but yeah, I mean, the way the NBA rules go, he's considered a rookie. I mean, so. he didn't play at all, actually. So. He didn't, yeah. And it's not like he went to college for four years and then came to the NBA and was injured for a season. Like, he's only, what, 20 years old? It's not like he's a 23-year-old. 
I could see you disagreeing with it if it was like a 23 year old that was going for uh, rookie of the year, but it's hard for me to argue against Ben Simmons. MBOG or Buck? I'll take Buck. Yeah, I don't. Because you just said you, you call me Rice Guy. You said you said yeah, <laughs> you're not on Wu's side right now. He uh, definitely got the card. You guys don't know about this, question. but like in this channel. I run the thing behind, the behind scenes. Since when? When was the last time you did anything? So you besides? call me, you call me Rice Gum one more time. <laughs> this YouTube channel might not exist. Anymore. Okay, okay, yeah. That Wu definitely has the power to do that. Why does Lonzo have two nights? Because he's a hype beast. Yeah, EA is 100% hype beast. That is what they're all about. And they don't care about real skill. They just want whoever's gonna sell. What are you doing? This man. What are you doing? I just kept seeing him. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is he saying I'm gonna hack you? Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, if anyone's gonna hack him. Yeah, if you ever see a tweet and it looks like something that I didn't tweet, it was definitely Woo. AD is not going to words. They can afford. No way. You're I'm fired or nerd beam gaming? Definitely you're fired. <laughs> Guess who I'm no picking? Contest. Huh? Guess who I'm picking? Third beam? No. I'm not. Okay, that's what. Right. Simmons suck. You suck. <laughs> Do you even know who your fired is? No. Yeah, I didn't think so. I did a video with him one time. Mm. The kid. Who should I buy, Curry or John Wall? John, Curry. John Wall. Curry. John Wall. Devin Booker or Clay Thompson? What's, what's going on with Roland? What's he up to? What's going on with Roland? I'm at him too. Yeah, we got to meet Roland whenever he came to Charlotte. I don't know. Roland hasn't been putting out. Maybe I just haven't been paying attention, but I haven't really seen any videos from Roland recently. Yeah, all, the, all Bobby does is make me. Well, all you do is go to work and sleep, and videos are my work, so. Wait, duh, how do you have 17 million coins? Uh, duh, coin sponsors. But they gone. They're gone, so but I saved up what I had before. You want to do something with them? I'm waiting on something that I need to buy. And until then, I'm going to let... I'm going to use other people's accounts to do gameplay. <laughs> Most improved player. That's a good one we haven't oh, talked about. Um, any player that came off the OKC. <laughs> Oladipo. Oladipo's in there. Capella's in there. Um, Can we Capella? Yeah. Where did he come from? He's been at the Rockets. He's just improved. They don't have to leave a team to improve. Um, I think Aaron Gordon, at the beginning of the season, he was really improved. I don't know how much he's improved since then. Aaron Gordon? Aaron Gordon? A. A. Ron Gordon. Who's Aaron Gordon? He's for, uh, he plays for the Magic. Should've won oh. the gun. He should've won the dunk contest against Zach Levine, but he got hit. Do you think the Lakers will try to buy a really good player? Yeah. yeah. They always try to buy good players. They're cleaning up space. Mm -hmm. I, I did not purposefully insert an ad if there was one placed in there, but that is how I make money. So, Bradley Beal or Donovan Mitchell? Right now, still Bradley Beal. Donovan, it could be changed in a couple years, but right now, definitely Bradley Beal. Donovan Mitchell is definitely a Rookie of the Year candidate, but See, he's still got to wait. I don't even him. know. I don't even think Bobby knows the one is that to pick the all-star, all-time starting five. I could probably pick the all-time starting five. Honestly, most people would probably say Muggsy just because he's more well-known. Uh, but he wasn't really that great. So I'm going to take Kemba as starting point guard. Del Curry as shooting guard. You know. Uh, for small forward, can I take can I take Gerald Wallace from the Bobcats? Is that allowed? I'm trying to think if we've had any other great small forwards, um, and I don't think I know Larry Johnson would be power forward and Alonzo Mourning would be center. Uh, I'm trying to think if we've had any other great small forwards, and I feel like we haven't. So yeah, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take Gerald Wallace at small forward. Glenn Rice, yep, you're right. Glenn Rice at small forward. New Saturday. My bad. Today is Saturday. Hey, it's 9.30. You know what happens at 9.30. Is it 9? Oh, it is 9.30. Do, we re do you really want to? What, where are we going to go? Boy, use your own... No, use your own phone. I got to read the comments. I don't have... Go get your phone. 
Go get your phone. Why don't you have your phone? Because I'm charging it. You never... Well, we're about to leave, so go get your phone. What do I think about Jordan Bell? He is crazy athletic and just needs to hone his abilities. You know what else? Huh? Ha 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 ha. Have you ever went into a small YouTuber stream? Yes, I do it pretty frequently. How is the auction house fixed? I don't know what you mean. I'm not sure what you're asking. What is good, JH? Thanks for joining the stream. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Where are we going? I'm not sure yet. Woo's the one that wants to go out. Woo's always the one that wants to go out, and I'm the one that wants to stay at home and play 2K. That's typically how it goes. DeAndre Jordan to the Cavs. I think we've already... If it's just for Tristan Thompson, I don't think they do it. But I think if they were getting other pieces... Who's... Who's did you go to? I don't know what you're asking. Is the auction house fixed? I still don't know what you're asking. Do you like NBA Live Mobile? Sometimes. Sometimes I really hate it. <laughs> Kemba is trash. You are wrong. You are wrong! Do you think... Who do you think should be captains in the All-Star Game? I think it should be LeBron and KD. That would definitely make it the most interesting. What? They all is in what? Coffee shops? No, they don't. We didn't even leave the house till 10 o'clock last time. Okay, look at that one. Who's the best in the NBA? We have some player. Okay. Do you want to go? I mean, I want to go, but I shouldn't say bye right now. Yeah, we can end the stream if we need to. All right, one last question. One real good question. One more question to Real end the good stream, question, guys. and you get a shout out, plus you get little, you get your question answered, and you get your little snippet, because that's the last question. Whoever asks the best question, this is going to be Instead the last of question we answer. Who's better, KD or LeBron or MJ or Kobe? Real good question that Real no one question. has asked before. Yep. What's the meaning of life? <laughs> meaning of life is... <laughs> Bobby versus Wu in real life. That's a good question, but not good enough. I don't like you. Who is the best basketball player? No. That's not. Nope. Do you think NBA Live would get better than last year? No. Why did you start YouTube? Because he's bored. I was bored. Yeah. Should, should the Lakers go for Paul George? No. Are you getting them? Who's better? That's... Come on. Good questions! We need good questions right here. It's not who's better than this, who's better than this, but like a... Like a it shouldn't be an or question. It should require an expanded response. Who's, like, come on, guys. You gotta have better questions than this. Why do you support the worst team at <laughs> That's a good question. Why do you support the <laughs> Nope. Who has the... Okay, that's a knowledge question, not an opinion question. We need opinion questions. Dwight Howard Hall of Fame. That's a pretty good question. No. My favorite YouTuber, I've already answered that. Northern Line. Hmm. Hey, Northern Line, if you're watching this, I love you. <laughs> Why would Northern Line be watching an NBA he Live? He says he watches, show? like, at night, he just watches an NBA Live show. <laughs> Which two... How do you feel about college and f your future? Ah, uh, that's a pretty good question, but it's kind of ambiguous. He's graduating this semester. Yeah, I'm graduating. If I don't bother him too much. What's your opinion on the Logan Paul videos? <laughs> Okay, and we will He's avoid that. Stupid. Who's Why do the Sixers player? always lose? Why do you test? <laughs> do I stutter? <laughs> Who's a better post fadeaway? Come on. There's gotta be a great question. Favorite breakfast food? Eh, that's a pretty good question. Thank you. I Can you end the question? Can I do you think Kristoff will be better than Giannis if he becomes the next LeBron? No, that's uh, not a question. That's just all-time dream team. It's a good question, but I've said it too many times on stream before. What do I think about Lou Will? Eh. Will I do YouTube full time when I graduate? Probably. How does it make sense that Lonzo Ball and Kyle Kuzma have more All-Star votes than Jimmy Ball? Jimmy, there are too many casual fans in the NBA. Easy answer. I mean, you can you can go ahead and answer, but because hype beast. Yeah. Well, high beast and casual NBA fans. I mean, yeah, the more uh, mm -hmm. the more likes you get, mm -hmm. or like just because a YouTube page has two million subscribers doesn't mean that that's they're the best 
YouTube channel. Exactly. Like this, only, this guy only has like seventy two. He's I. <laughs> Who do I think will be the best player in ten years out of the rookies? That's a pretty good question. Devin Booker. He's not a rookie. Woo. Ben Simmons. <laughs> Best player in 10 years out of the rookie. So I'm probably going to answer this one as my final question. Best player in 10 years. This time, this year's rookie? Oh my goodness. Well, I think Lonzo, just the fact that he's like a soul. Like, the Lakers are never training. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I would say best rookie in 10 years. And don't leave. <laughs> Don't leave before uh, we end the stream because we're going to raid somebody else's stream to end it. But I would say the best rookie in 10 years. So I don't think it'll be Lonzo. I think Lonzo will turn out to be a decent player. I don't think it's going to be Jason Tatum because while he is a very consistent player, I think most of his success is coming from the system that he's been put into. Justin Jackson. I don't think it'll be Kuzma because... Well, Kuzma will be good, but I think he'll be primarily a scorer and not a multi-dimensional player. I think it's going to come down to Donovan Mitchell and Ben Simmons. And I'm going to go with Ben Simmons just because we've never really seen a rookie that can do what he can do. Like nearly, okay, he's not nearly averaging a triple-double anymore, but the dude is just a straight-up monster. Like... There, you barely ever see rookies doing what he's doing right now. So I would say, in my opinion, the rookie that's going to be the best in 10 years is going to be Ben Simmons. So, we're going to go raid somebody's stream right now. We're going to raid Gangsta Plays Mobile. I'm going to spam his link down in the comment section, guys. Go tell him that Bobby Bucket sent you... Gangsta Plays, <laughs> I think that was right. Yep, Gangsta Plays Mobile. We're gonna go raid this dude's stream. Go show him some love. Tell him that Bobby sent you. Dude, We're gonna, nope, team, just found his stream. I never hate it. Go turn up the I volume, them, see his response. But I don't like the fact that, like, I know uh, Claro Brown, you're not a bandwagon, Let's but like. See. Bobby raid. I don't like the fact when. I'll, uh, Bobby Ray, stop playing, stop playing, you play. All right. Stop playing, Willie. Go raid the dude's stream, guys. <gasps> I'm getting raided again. Go no. show him some love. No. What the fuck? Well, language. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, we're uh, we gotta turn off the turn off the language, but go like up his stream, everybody. Thank you for joining our stream. Yo. Yo, oh, 41 to 8, that's a blowout right there. Hope you enjoy, sir. Make sure to like up his stream. I don't even know who this is. This was just the first one that I saw down below. But uh, hope you have an awesome day, sir. Hope you all have an awesome day as well. Yep, he's going crazy. Let's see, is he still swearing? <laughs> I'm trying not to have... Let's see. Let's pull up. Who is Bobby? Curry. How do you not know who Bobby Curry. is? Curry. Oh, Mama Bucket's Curry. raid in the stream as well. We got 46 people over there. We got a Bobby raid going on. Hey, all right. Keep up the grind, bro. Thank you, everybody, for joining. Make sure to drop a like on my stream and his stream and subscribe here and subscribe over there as well. And I'll see you guys next time.